Hello friends, this is Arun and welcome to my channel for the show of photography, Lightroom as well as video editing tutorials. So today I will teach you how to get this, this is 3D pop-up effect using Photoshop CS6. So let's see how to get this type of effect using Photoshop. So firstly, uh, open an image that you want and uh, make three copies of uh, same image, same layer by pressing Ctrl J. Okay. Now make a new layer also and uh, drag it to down and uh, uh, we have this background layer and fill it with black color by pressing alt backspace. So select empty layer that I have made and name it frame. frame. Now go to rectangle marquee tool and uh, take a selection. Uh, something like this okay now go to select then transform selection then right click on there and choose perspective and position it what you want so I want this type of position okay uh, this is right and click on okay now go to edit now go to stroke in stroke choose color gray and uh, pixel i want 20 inside i want then click on okay now hide this layer topmost layer and you will see this frame and Press Ctrl D to deselect selection and uh, select this layer, frame layer and uh, go to magic wand tool, click outside of this frame. Now you will get the selection. Now click on layer, this layer, second layer and click on mask by pressing Alt on the keyboard. Now you will get this type of effect now I will go to this layer and make it active and uh, I will take a selection by choosing quick selection tool on the now take a selection on the cat Okay, if you are coming out of the uh, this selection, then press Alt on the keyboard and delete it, minus it. Now go to Refine Edge Tool. Now click on Smart Radius, and uh, I want smoothness around 40. Then click on OK. Now click on this mask so the selection is incomplete here so I will take selection again by pressing ctrl Z okay that's fine Now again click on mask so you will get this now make a uh, select this layer black background now choose this uh, gradient and make sure you have this black to white gradient I want and uh, fill there so proposes regular try once again Uh, press shift key on the keyboard then you will get this straight gradient now make a new layer also and uh, take a selection of this uh, frame now select this empty layer fill it with black control D and go to filter then blur then goes in blur 
so that you can get shadow of this okay click on okay and uh, control t Now see the effect. 